Hello, everybody. I'm Mohammed. Uh, I work at Rackspace as a customer reliability engineer. I'm also part of the Knative uh, Productivity Working Group. So, for those of you who don't know, that working group is responsible for the test infrastructure, our GitHub repositories, and all the testing that we do. So, in November, Google announced that they were donating Knative to the CNCF Foundation. Um, as part of that incubation journey, um, Google, sorry, so Google used to run the uh, testing infrastructure, and as part of the incubation journey, Google have announced that they're also going to hand over the control of the infrastructure to the community. So, so that journey took about four months or so, and we spent a lot of time working out the infrastructure that Google owned, um, get a list of everything that Google owned work out what we needed to keep, what we don't need. Um, as part of that journey, we also managed to save a fair amount of money by turning off features that we weren't using in Google Cloud. Okay, uh, we also rebuilt our Prow clusters. So Prow is the CI CD tool that we use to test our PRs that we have, and it also runs some, some of the more important uh, tasks that we've got, so for example, when there's a new volunteer that wants to work on a project, they go to GitHub, sign themselves up, and this is one of the tools that we use to invite them to the organization. Uh, we've also started hardening our test infrastructure. So the test infrastructure runs jobs that are submitted by end users, so we've got to make sure that the infrastructure that runs on is very secure. Hopefully, we'll have more updates to share at the next KNDivCon. Um, so what did we inherit from Google? So we managed to get three domains from Google, a bunch of GitHub bot accounts. Um, Google also used to run the Kennedy.team Google Workspace. So this is where we've got our calendar, our shared drives, and there's a couple of emails that we have. Uh, we also inherited the entire Google Cloud organization that backs all of our tests, testing infrastructure. So it's about 110 Google projects. So that includes the projects that hold our testing infrastructure, the project that holds our releases, and a pool of some 100 Boscos projects. So those are the projects that we use to spin up GKE clusters for testing. So what's next for, for us, for the productivity working group? So this testing infrastructure that we inherited from Google, uh, there's a lot of improvements that we need to make. Uh, so we're gonna be doing those improvements over the summer. Um, we also want to adopt some interesting features from GCP um, and some other tools used by Kubernetes. We share the same testing infrastructure. Uh, we both use Prow and Google Cloud, and they've solved some interesting problems over the years that we need to take a look at and see if they're relevant to us. We also looking into hardening the re release process. Um, there's some improvements to be made there, and hopefully we'll have more announcements to share about that when the project has started for that. And that's it for me. Thank you.